The Places of St. Gerard Faith, Charm and Simplicity The travellers go along the corridor siding the basilica, accompanied by a stunning environment which puts them in the story of the saint, his miracles frozen in time by the pictures on the walls, portraying faithful people healed thanks to his intercession and ex voto with hearts or other parts of the body that received a miracle. St. Gerard's Museum, annexed to the church, contains liturgic furniture, holy vestments and 17th century works of art, and especially objects linked to the saint, such as handwritten letters, ex voto, penitence tools, paintings with episodes and miracles of his life, the first tomb and the four urns that kept his body until the year 2000. Among the penitence tools, there is a metal heart with pointed edges used by the saint to wound his chest. There is also a reconstruction of the bedroom St. Gerard had in Mater Domini on the basilica side, in the last part of the long corridor of the convent. Redecorated with ancient objects and a terracotta tile floor of the 18th century, it allows you to see the simple and religious poverty of the saint. St. Gerard's well dates back to 1600 and is near the sacristy. It is a cistern for rainwater used by the religious people for all their everyday needs and probably by the saint too to take the mass ampulas, as well as by the thirsty and tired pilgrims.